<laughs> yeah, probably. Who wants to chalk up the sidewalk? Over yeah. Here. yeah, if you really want to bum out the people in line, go right on chalk on their sidewalk. I'm a bellman. What are we doing? Chalk up the sidewalk. <laughs> I would think past those cones it's blocked off, they wouldn't want people to be, but who knows, but... Or there's a, there's a barricade oh, thing over there, there too, so... I guess some people intend to chalk in front of the building, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna provide some backup footage here just in case they're descended upon or anything like that. Now there's the front of the line, so chalkings would be most effective where everyone going in can see them. But if it's in the immediate space in front of Gibson's, I could also see them sending someone out to clear it away and possibly telling people they have to leave that area or something because you gotta be very cautious when police have things like that set up, see these little barricades, because then they can start demanding, like those barricades mean something and you're not allowed to be here. So you gotta be careful of that. That's Ray Duckler from the monitor going over there now. Looks like there's a line inside too. Traffic's getting a little heavy here. Be regular traffic. Here's the press is in as well.
But my, my, my good friend of a friend told me that she was there at the early birthday and she was like, actually, I don't know. What do you expect to do about the minimum wage? Because she no longer has any power. Well, as you know, Secretary Clinton had adopted a $15 per hour minimum wage into her campaign. She may have gotten enough votes to actually win. Right. Well, Sanders is a fraud. He's not a Democrat. He's never been a Democrat. And he's spoiled this election. Thank you for your concern. Oh, come on. That's not good language. Oh, don't care, right? We got some more chalk. Oh, wow. Alright, there's a little bit more here. Anybody want to write with chalk on the sidewalk? You gotta use it up. Just let them know what we're about. What are we, what are we missing here? Data. Who's my candidate? I no, absolutely not. No, f that guy too. Hi, right, once again, of course, I'm Vermin Supreme. My I'm candidates here to are here, my man. New book here today. Um, it's called I Pony Blueprint for New America. Uh, it's about a story about uh, why I lost the election. Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away. Go away. Oh, come on. That's an intelligent argument right there. I've <laughs> been invading my personal space. Go away. You're on a public you sidewalk. You are single invading my personal space. Okay, you're on a public sidewalk. Come on down. Hi, this is my new book, uh, Blueprint for New America. I hope you'll enjoy reading it. It's about the future. You like the future, right? <laughs> Hi, I'm Bernie Supreme. I'm here promoting my new book. Hillary uh, Clinton is a criminal! Woo! Okay, uh, what you get, of course, is my new book, I Pony, the Future for New America. It's available on Amazon. I hope you read it. It's about life in the future, long after my presidency, when uh, everybody has their ponies, when time travel is commonplace, when uh, zombies fuel the nation from our need, and uh, the secret death of police have checked for the it's a warning to you, the people of the present, to the uh, people of the future, to the
I thought it was only fair that I you know, find new book because I was paid.
I find that the chalk goes very far on this surface, the marble or granite. Okay, I'm going to do a little reading here from my book. Zira came back to the lab to check on the